Well, neighbors are calling a secret commuter shortcut a dangerous stretch of road in Sacramento County. It's located on South River Road, north of Clarksburg, and a deadly head on collision this morning shut down traffic there for hours. CBS 13's Ron Jones spoke with concerned neighbors who say crashes are becoming commonplace now. Well, as you can see, officers are wrapping up this scene. However, neighbors tell CBS 13 that folks drive way too fast on this narrow road. The driver of the Honda Civic uh, is deceased as a result of the collision. Twisted metal and tragedy on this two-lane stretch of South River Road. This deadly head-on collision is about four miles north of the community of Clarksburg. The driver of this crushed sedan was pronounced dead at the scene. The person driving the pickup truck survives. The conditions on this road are not conducive to speed. Residents who live on this quiet, tranquil roadway just parallel to the Sacramento River say they're seeing an increase of collisions in their neighborhood. We've had about three people crash in front of our house. It's fairly regular throughout the years. Terry and Allison Cox blame this recently constructed Kasumnas River Interstate 5 overpass. It connects South Sacramento to the Riverside neighborhood. The Cox family believes when I-5 commuters get stuck in traffic, they use their community as a shortcut to reduce the drive time to West Sacramento and downtown Sacramento. Well, it's at least 60 and up to 70 to 80 on this road. Until now, the Cox say very few people knew about the road. And so what's happened is people are figuring it out. They believe unless people slow down, more lives will be cut short on this newly found shortcut. I fear for the safety of my family, my neighbors, people rolling through. Um, I mean, it's, it's, it's just it's become pretty insane out here, actually. Now, the pickup truck driver was taken to the UC Davis Medical Center with minor injuries. The driver of the Honda Civic has not yet been identified.